Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Elena. Привет! I'm a Russian-American makeup and beauty addict. I usually review inexpensive, affordable makeup from AliExpress, drugstore, dollar store. I'll test it all myself and I'll pass the savings to you guys. So this is the video about, um, a little different, about my self tanning products. I've been self tanning lately a lot for summer, although we never go out anymore, but I'm still self tanning. <laughs> So I'm going to be listing the products that I like and the products that work for me and let's have a conversation what you like and what we don't like. So if you're interested then keep on watching, don't forget to subscribe and ring the notification bell. I upload every Monday, Wednesday and Friday at 11 a.m. Pacific time. Give this video a thumbs up, it helps me and leave me a comment. Let's get right into this. So let's get right into this short and sweet video. So this is what this was requested actually by one of my new subscribers. Her name is Alexandra. I'm pretty sure I'm pronouncing it correctly because in Russian it would be Alexandra, and usually we call them Sasha. Well, that's Russian way. I don't know how you guys say it in. Um, Poland, right? So this is one of my new subscribers from uh, Polish descent and I'm Russian, she's Polish, so kind of like, oh, it's my, my Eastern European friend. So <laughs> she's been really active and commenting, which I really love. It's the fun about YouTube, talking, you know, talking to each other and getting to know different people. So she asked me about my self tanning routine. I'm like, hmm. Is anybody actually interested? And she says, yes. I'm like, okay, might as well. So I've been a fan of self tanning for a long time. Ever since uh, I moved to Florida in 1998 from my country, from Moldova, um, I've been tanning and I'm not gonna lie, I was an idiot, I didn't use sunscreen and I spent a lot of time in the sun. I have some sunspots on my face and I have a couple of moles that were removed last year because they're a little suspicious. So I'm like, Ugh. I've been real good with su sunblock, sunblock every day, sunblock SPF 50, my face, my arms, my legs, everything. I cycle with long sleeves. I ride my bike and I run, everything also long sleeves, even in the warm weather. Weather, I mean, I'm like petrified now. <laughs> so I'm really careful with my face and everything, but I still want to be tan. So there comes my favorite sunscreen, I mean, self tanning lotion, summer color, self tanning lotion, deep dark color by Banana Boat. Yes. I like affordable brands on this channel. Yeah. And it works. I mean, it has six ounces. It's right now on Walmart website. It's six seventy something. Let me see. Uh, Seven forty four actually. Walmart website. So if you are in US and you have a Walmart nearby, they are usually stocked up on the shelves, or you can order from Walmart. They are available on Amazon. But right now, this deep dark color is out of stock and the light medium is in stock. So what for me I like to do, I like to mix this with any body lotion because if it's too deep, it might be a little orange and streaky. So I like to build it up. I'll mix half, like a little pump and a little pump of any body lotion, mix it together on my hand and apply. You have to be very careful and very thorough applying because it does not have a color guard, it's white. I'm going to show you a little bit. I mean, I don't want to create mess on my hand, but I mean, just with the reference, it's clear, it's white. It smells nice. It has the same set that it had scent that it's had for years, kind of like a flowery scent. Some people are not into flowers, <laughs> but I do like it. It's real nice. It used to have a color guard, meaning it used to be a little like a brown. I mean, a lot brown. It was like dark. So this is a color that would be staining everything. So when you apply that, but you would see where you apply it. So I used to like it more, I think, when it had a color guard, but it still works as good. It is as good. I would say it lasts like a three day, three, three days you're gonna look dark and then reapply. So I would say after the shower, I apply it all over my body, either with a, a lotion, with a body lotion mixed in or itself. 
uh, I would mix it to be more even, like it really gives you a better canvas. And every two days, every other day, you can I reapply in the shower. And it's good to exfoliate. So I exfoliate once, I don't know, once a week, once every 10 days. When I see that, you know, it accumulates, usually like here on my arms, it accumulates like low patches or on my ankles. And you can see, so I use my favorite scrub. Oh my God, guys, if you have Walmart, <laughs> I'm a Walmart hoe, you can tell. Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub, Moroccan oil, a Moroccan rose, excuse me. This smells like heaven. I'm like, if I put my nose here, I could just live in there. I could like swim there and live there in this bottle. <laughs> I don't know. In a sense, a very finicky case, very subjective. People either love it or hate it. Some people probably wouldn't like it. it's a rose, but it doesn't smell like roses, roses, you know? It's like a very specific scent. Mm, it's heavenly, just heavenly. I actually liked it so much, I bought a body wash on Amazon and I bought uh, a body lotion with the same scent. Uh, tree hut. I'm going to try to find an Amazon listing and uh, list all of these items in the description box because this scrub, it just just the smell alone is like. Mm. So you exfoliate, so get rid of all the you know build up, and then, and then you can start building up your tan again. You know, once in a while, excuse me, we get in my face. Once in a while, it feels like. The color build up so much, you have to start new. So I won't apply anything for like a week and I'll keep scrubbing and then I'll start again from scratch. So what I use for my face? I like this one. Uh, Ten Y Self Tanning Face Gel. Again, this is good for the US residents because this is from Sally's. I think they have Sally's Beauties in UK, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I'm gonna look up if I find a link for UK. I'm gonna leave it in the description box. But this is what look, look, it looks like. I'm sure this has been on my shelf for a while. I think they changed the look now. It looks a little different because I just looked on Sally's website. And this one is, let me see. This one is $6.99 now, Sally's. And it looks a little different. It's a picture. So I think they'll change the look. But it is dark. This one is dark. I'm not going to squeeze it, so I mean, I will just a little bit so you can see. And it's just like a gel texture. So this is great for the face. I'm going to tell you why. Just a gel. Smells kind of weird. It's like a typical self tanner smell, but it doesn't bother me. Uh, so here's the thing. If you apply, I apply. Let's talk about me. If I apply this on my face, I'm going to break out. It doesn't matter that I'm 45. I'm going to black out, black, black. <laughs> break out. So my face is really sensitive to those kind of things. This is for the body. So if I put that on my face, no, no doesn't work. But this never breaks me out. Um, I would say it's really not necessary because if I use something like this on my face, it doesn't really last that well because I exfoliate, I use um, uh, different vitamin C creams and different serums that really exfoliate the face, you know, the chemical exfoliators. A retinol, and I use other things that really help with the face, so it really doesn't stay. But I do use it once every few days. So that's that. What I did like from Amazon, which I'm going to use, uh, I'm going to link the next item, that's San Marit's self tanning Mousse. Here's the thing with San Marit's. It looks like this. I'm going to link this. It's $9.99 now. But the thing is, it has a color guard. So it's a pump. You pump it out. It looks like this. It legit looks like this. Dark. So you pump it out and it's it's a different texture. It's not lotion. So it's drying, I would say. So when you apply it after the shower, you have to be really careful and you have to wear gloves. I didn't wear gloves and wash your hands of that. It's like you literally have black hands, black. With this, it doesn't happen. With that one, woo, it would stain and you have to scrub your hands off. So I ended up just using regular disposable plastic gloves. 
you know, like the ones you put the hair color on with, it worked, but it was very messy. And also it's a color guard, so you're supposed to shower it off. But I didn't even read the instructions because I ain't got time for that. So I got that mousse and I'm like, I can't, don't have time for instructions. I don't do that. So I just applied it and I lived with it. I went to the next day and the next day it was so dark. I stained everything. <laughs> So I hate the color guard. If I have to rinse something off in the shower a few hours later, mm -hmm, I'm not doing it. It's just too much work. So I just used it as is. I was so dark. I was like ridiculously dark. But it's just so much work and so much stain. So mm, I like this better. It's less expensive. works just as well. It might be a little less intense, but it works real nicely. So the only thing is, as I said, with the stains, the St. Marie's one was really staining. This one still stains a little bit. So, like, the inside of the bra is going to be a little bit brown-ish. Not brown, but, like, a little orangey. And the sheets are going to be a little orange, too. And the pillowcase a little bit. So, you'll see a little here and there. But it doesn't bother me. I mean, it comes out and I wash. Uh, my husband always laughs because when we get up, and you see his spot in the bed and my spot. My spot looks like you just killed the bug and it left a little trace. <laughs> it literally looks like a dead bug there, but I mean, it's my self tanner. I can't help it. I love to be tan. I don't care. I don't. So if that bothers you, you're probably not going to like it, but I don't think there are any self tanners that don't stain. They all do that. So it's either being tan or not having stains and I choose to be tan. So that's my routine. It's pretty much very simple. So I don't do the St. Marie's anymore. So this is my go-to and this is my go-to for the face. So you can find both on Amazon. I find that Amazon is more expensive than Walmart. But if you don't have Walmart nearby, you can look this up on Amazon and uh, this one Sally website. So that's it. That's my routine. So if you enjoy this, give this thumbs up. Let me know what your routine is like because I'm nosy too. I want to know what you use. You know, maybe I'll find something better for myself. <laughs> so leave me a comment below. Let me know what your favorite uh, self tanning lotion is or whatever you use. And let's talk about this uh, important business. <laughs> so like this video. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet uploaded every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 11 a.m. Pacific time. So I'll see you guys in my next video. And thank you for watching. <laughs> Bye.